if you've just taken your Mother 32 out of the box, it's pretty easy to connect. Most of the connections are on the back panel. So I'm going to turn it over here. And there they are. Power in and sound out. Power comes by way of a wall mount transformer. And just plug it in there. You notice that there is no on off switch and that's okay with an analog synthesizer. It's not a bad idea to leave them warmed up. That makes them more stable, particularly in the pitch. You also have an output for your headphones or for a line level tip and sleeve instrument connection. I'll plug that in here. Turn it back over again. The master volume control is up here in the upper right to make sure that's turned up or you'll be very frustrated because you won't hear anything. There's a few different ways of playing your Mother 32. There is actually a small built-in keyboard here along the bottom, these little rubber buttons. You can just press these to play notes. There's also a built-in sequencer and you just start it and stop it here. If you have an external MIDI controller or a MIDI output from your computer, you plug it into the MIDI jack here. I'll plug in my MIDI cable. And now I can go ahead and play my MIDI controller keyboard. And if your external controller has an arpeggiator or sequencer, you can use that as well. In the following movies and chapters, we're going to show you how to program sounds on the Mother 32. It breaks down into a few basic sections. Up here in the upper left is the oscillator or the main tone generator. It's also where you tune your instrument. In the middle section is the filter, which is the main tone shaping part of your instrument. It's how you decide what frequencies or harmonics of your oscillator get through to the output. And in the upper right corner is the amplifier, which does the final loudness shaping of your sounds. In the middle left is the low frequency oscillator, which is one of your main modulation sections to add animation to sounds. And then roughly in the middle is the envelope generator, which is what adds a contour to every note that you play. For example, a very fast attack and medium to slow decay here and just show you quick adjustments. As I already briefly showed you, here along the bottom is the built-in keyboard and the sequencer section of the instrument, and we'll be spending a whole chapter showing you how to program its sequencer. And then finally here at the far right is the patch bay. This is how you override the internal wiring of the Mother 32 to create some alternative sounds. You can use these patch cords, which come supplied with your Mother 32, to both override the internal wiring to create some brand new sounds, and also, most importantly, connect it to other modules to expand the capabilities of the Mother 32. And indeed, that's going to be the main focus of our course. But we're getting ahead of ourselves. In the next movie, I'm going to show you the basic settings for all of these controls to get a good starter sound or patch out of the instrument.